Hello there, uh, my name is Osama and I'm a student in the Faculty of Engineering, Alexandria University, uh, in fourth year. And uh, my graduation project is to design a left ventricle assist device, uh, which is basically a support for the heart. You have a pump that's uh, taken from the left ventricle to uh, travel, travel the blood to the hour okay so uh, a little overview uh, I'll link uh, my uh, CV in the description uh, you can feel free uh, to call me this is my email and this is my phone okay uh, so a little overview of the product and about this tutorial and what would be the out okay so as we have talked about this is a product about left ventricle assist device so it's basically a pump so uh, what I'm gonna show you is to how uh, it's a pump just from scratch and how to simulate it in uh, simulation softwares okay so uh, speaking engineering uh, uh, we have uh, the uh, left ventricle assist device taken from the left ventricle to support it uh, blood in the out okay so when you're talking about engineering we talk about flow rate and pressure okay so pressure here is uh, 100 to uh, 140 which is systolic blood pressure and the systolic blood pressure which is 3 to 12 and in the uh, outlet port we have 1 to 100 to 140 and 60 to 90 so we have to select a time point a time point is uh, at the uh, maximum uh, head and the maximum flow rate okay so uh, we take an average value of the uh, outlet port which is between 100 and 140 let it say be uh, 120 uh, millimeter uh, mercury which is equivalent to uh, 1.56 uh, meter of head okay so we have the design point pressure at 120 millimeter mercury okay and we need the flow rate so flow rate based on previous studies we know that the human heart flow rate is between uh, 4 and 5 maybe up to 6 liter per minute and its maximum value is uh, about 7 liter per minute so we take that time point Q and head so Q will be 5 liter per minute and head will be 120 millimeter mercury okay okay so uh, when we uh, finish uh, this tutorial we will be able to uh, model the uh, impeller create the impeller of course and model it uh, through a uh, turbo grid which is a very useful tool um, and the software and we hey, you can uh, see that uh, the uh, mesh is quite structural and it's very useful tool turbo grid other that you can get a very unstructured uh, mesh on the impeller so we uh, as you see in the inlet port uh, we, can, we will uh, do this and uh, as for the uh, results on the impeller we can show the wall shear okay uh, and uh, compare it with the uh, biomedical considerations uh, to prevent thrombosis or hemolysis okay so uh, after that uh, we know the, the pump consists of an impeller and a volute so we will create also the volute and uh, we will have the setup for the impeller and the volute both uh, which is other and uh, for the results we will uh, show the streamlines pressure distribution on the impeller pressure distribution on the volute uh, and the shear stress uh, all over the uh, pump okay uh, so uh, this uh, study is you know uh, we have taken about uh, of, mm, from five to six months to uh, make this pump just really working on the software 
so uh, I hope that you can find it uh, very useful for you and uh, feel free to uh, call me or just send me uh, through uh, the email okay okay 